Well, hi, I'm Stephen Briggs. I did the sleeve notes for Terry Pratchett's Vinyl Discworld. And this is just to let you see what's inside the box. Now, quite a substantial item this is. Let me turn this down so you can see better. Nice snazzy box. I'll do it this way up so you can see better. Elegant design. Really smooth fit, a bit like an iPhone. And inside, we've got a very nice graphic of Terry with the Discworld superimposed onto him, all in keeping with the overall design. And then in there, we've got first one, Mort. Cool graphic on the front, as you see, and on the back. And then what I think of as being a sleeve opens up and you get cast list and a brilliantly written set of uh, sleeve notes by me. Within that is what I believe in the technical term they call the bag. Each of the vinyls that are in here, this one has on it quotation from the story and a portion of a large map of the Discworld. Once you have taken... There we are, this is the first vinyl for Mort. Very cool graphic look. If you've taken all of these bags out, then you go to make a very large map of Discworld. So that's Mort, Mort. And inside Mort, beyond that one, we have Weird Sisters, cool Grebo on the front, crown on the reverse, same deal with the uh, cast list and brilliant sleeve notes, and again the baggie on the inside, quotation on the front of each one, and part of the map design on the back. I'll try and dig through and find one of the later ones, I might have more of the actual map as we go through. Guards, guards, nice one with the watch and the dragon on the front and the watch badge on the back of it. This one's got three discs in it. But again, cast notes, sleeve notes. Eric, Faust, the luggage, snapping fingers, sleeve notes. Let's see what we get on this one. Ooh. This one shows you, you get half of the map, and like I say, you put all of these together, if you've got a floor enough, a wall enough, or maybe even two copies you can paste onto your wall, you'll get a complete map of the disc world, based on the design which Terry Pratchett and I put together back in the 90s, maybe. What a map building work going on then. We'd already mapped a city, that's not going right. Already mapped a city. We then went on to map the entire disc world. Bearing in mind I hadn't done geography or anything else. Quite an achievement. And Eric, now we get Small Gods, many people's favourite disc world book. And there's the eagle with the turtle, tortoise, which will end up being Om. And there he is, dropping out of the sky. Notes and stuff. Night Watch, another big favourite with fans. Goes back to Vimes' origins, Tower of Art in the front. And uh, there's Corporal Little Biddle just knocking his coffin there. And then last but not least, we've got the non disc world one. Only You Can Save Mankind. One of the Johnny Maxwell trilogy. Game player on the back, cool purpley black designs there. So all in all, a pretty snazzy looking set of discs you get for your complete set. Both good for all you completists that enjoyed the original dramas on the BBC radio and would like to have copies for people who love to have their sound on vinyl. Of course it's ideal, 
to people like me that don't have vinyl, it's a really cool thing to own and to display in the house. So there you go. Terry Pratchett's Vinyl Discworld with sleeve notes by Stephen Briggs.